Yeah. Ha. Huh. When it all comes together. Sunday, August 14th, um, two weeks from yesterday, we'll be opening season for archery in Colorado. And uh, I'll say a few things that are helping me right now is the pre-aim. I don't know if I've talked to you guys about that, but that's actually before you draw back, you're looking at the trajectory of your arrow to try to determine your distance. I was having a really hard time with yardage until about two months ago. My friend Dave Zygman pointed that out to me give it a try you're basically looking down the sight of your arrow you're moving your head down a little bit looking down the sight of your arrow before you draw and then posting your front arm and drawing from there and trying to keep your front arm as still as possible and then run your shot the other thing is so pre-aiming is the first thing the second thing I take Joel Turner's course um, iron mine hunting if you haven't already go check out his videos on YouTube I seriously consider taking his course either live if you possibly can he travels around so you might be able to find a venue you could do that or at least uh, online, but uh, just having the the mental knowledge of what your body, what you're fighting against, and how you can control it, keep maintain control of your shot, is paramount. Um, maybe there's some good pointers there. Good luck to you guys as you prepare for hunting season coming up um, in Colorado. It's uh, 13 days away, so stay tuned for more as we prepare, and we're looking forward to seeing you in the outdoors. Even plus two. for a plus six and that's right on the ten for a plus two a plus eight and that's an even and a plus see it's hitting the ten ring right there Still judging the distance too short. That's a plus ten. Or a plus two, I mean. And a minus three. Another plus two, minus three. Plucked it. Ooh, just snuck out an even there and a minus three. Yes! Woo! Way to keep control. Moose at 40 yards. Woo! 
<laughs> Held that back way too long, but it went where I wanted it to. Let's take a look at these shots. Yeah, buddy. That is a 12. That's gonna do it. Bring back some score. And another 12. Right here is that 12 ring. I'm right on the edge of it. Not a perfect center on that one, but I'll take my eight points. I'm gonna try my audible cues out loud. See if this is distracting or if this helps me focus. Stance, shoulders down. Look at the target, look at your spot. Pre-aim, loose hands. Front shoulder down, loose hands. Draw, I'm gonna do this right. Anchor, keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling. Keep pulling. Yeah. Ha ha ha. That's what goes through my head. Uh, second one was not good. Plus two for a plus 12. And that right there is a neutral. Snuck one in there. See if I can get his friend right next to him. Yeah. Ha. Huh. When it all comes together. This is good. This is really good on this target. I'm usually hitting this low or high. I scored a four, two tens. That's plus 16. All right, man. This stuff's working. Bit low. I need to speed up. Just a little bit. That's a little granny gear. They're plus two and an even. I was 16 up, now I am 18 up. Oh no! Oh man! Minus three and an even. Oh, oh my streak of scores is over. Didn't break the line. Yeah. Plus two and an out. Minus three. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Plus two and an even. Aim too high, aim too low. Minus three and an even. I'm hitting lines today. I'm hitting rings. The edges, that is. I should have stayed where I was. We got two scores. Ooh. Well, and just snuck an even. Yep, still recording. One more shot. Even if I totally biffed this one, two misses, I'd still finish the best I ever have. What do you say? No, it's not a 10. Even and even. It's a plus 20 for the day. Oh, do the math. 28 points better than the best day I've ever had out here. Take a look at the time. It's 
So it took a little bit longer. Anyways, 38 minutes. Thanks for joining me. That's the best um, I've shot out here. Uh, 20 over. So 320 is the uh, course par. So I got 10s and 12s, which brings my score up to 340. That doesn't mean that you're an awesome hunter. It's just a gauge. The best I've ever shot here is a 312. That's that's really good. I've, I'm very, very pleased with that. So stay tuned for more as we prepare. And we're looking forward to seeing you in the outdoors. Stay primal.